G'day, I'm Josh, I'm a civil plan operator and I've been working in the industry for about five years. When I'm not building roads like this, I like to spend time with my daughter and that's why I need to go home safe. When you move around a construction site, you need to be aware of exclusion zones. It could be nightline like this, solid fencing or even a barrier. Exclusion zones are absolutely essential to everybody's safety. They can be created as part of a safe work method statement, or SWIMS, to allow a high risk activity to proceed. For example, the operation of mobile plant. Exclusion zones can be part of your site's traffic management plan. Exclusion zones are also needed around trenches of 1.5 metres or more. It's going to park down the back, but it'll be an exclusion zone around the scaffold. Listen up at your startups and toolbox talks, so you know where the exclusion zones are on your site. Never interfere with signage or barriers. You could put another worker's life at risk. If you need to gain access into an exclusion zone, find the site safety manager first before entering. Hey, you know what it's like. Sometimes you get a member of the public come into an exclusion zone like this. Stop them and safely escort them off the site. If you see anything unsafe about the exclusion zone, stop work. Tell your safety manager and get it fixed. When you're working around exclusion zones, think safe, Work safe, go home safe.